In the late 1800s, around 350 wealthy young American women married into the British nobility. The combined dowries of all of these young women contributed around 40 million pounds to the British economy, the equivalent to one billion pounds today. These American heiresses became known as dollar princesses. Often the families had descended from European immigrants and they lacked the social standing and acceptance that they yearned for. Mary Gallette was one of these American heiresses. She was the only daughter of a banker and a real estate tycoon in New York. Her family had been listed in the New York Times Best Families of New York. Mary Gallette met her soon-to-be husband, Henry Innes Kerr, the eighth Duke of Roxburgh, when she was a bridesmaid at Consuelo Vanderbilt's wedding, another dollar princess. When Mary Gallette married the Duke of Roxburgh, she was the second wealthiest American heiress to marry into the British aristocracy, bringing a dowry of $20 million in 1903. The only heiress that brought more money into Britain than Mary Gallette was her friend, Consuelo Vanderbilt. After marrying the eighth Duke of Roxburgh, she moved to Scotland and to Flores Castle. The money she brought into the marriage helped launch a major renovation scheme to the castle. 